What's up, everybody? Greedy P here. Welcome back to Mary Jersey. Here with another unboxing video. Today we got Food Stamps. Uh, Food Stamps is an original comic book and toy line uh, created by Rios Palante of Rios Toy Designs. I found out about Food Stamps, I believe, at 2019 New York Comic Con. Uh, while I was there walking around looking at different things. Um, so when I saw an opportunity to uh, get one of his figures, uh, I said, you know, I, I definitely got to do that. I got to compliment it. Uh, so today we got Screwface. This is one of, I think, uh, five or six different figures that they got for the Blue Stamps line. Uh, he has other other characters as well, uh, but today is Screwface, so let's get into that, alright? Alright, let's just show you some of the artwork here. Big number three on top of the box, I'm guessing because it's probably like the third figure in the line. I guess. Uh, so it says, who you down with? Kaiju killers, Fu crew, bloodsuckers. Uh, pink skeletons, Force 44s, Mech Mayhem. So I'm guessing these are all the different crews in the uh, comic book uh, and the story and all that. Only the strong survive. The X like that is cool. Uh, so face on this side. The box. Some of the artwork right here. Artwork here, right here, is pretty cool. Uh, you got a little bit of description here on the side for Screwface. It says Screwface was raised in and out of the foster care system. Uh, he had to be tough and defend himself at an early age. His trust runs razor thin as he is unwilling to put his fate in anyone's hands but his own. Face began to look to the streets. For his solitude where he learned how to strengthen his survival skills. He found a father figure in Sensei and the troubled team began to soften his exterior until the last person he trusted was kidnapped. Uh, the, dis the disappearance of Sensei drove an erratic face to resort to his street tactics and hunt down those who took his last hope of living a life of freedom. Now Screwface is on the edge of insanity, struggling with what is right and wrong while he scraps with other gangs in the area. Although the rest of the Foo crew want to help Face retrieve their sensei, they often battle over Screwface's bloody approach. And this is the battle. Website for uh, the, the personal website where you can buy uh, food stamps merch. Uh, Instagram, obviously, real design. So yeah, let's open this bad boy up. came off very simple so, cut styrofoam here comes in a plastic bag that is, uh, so this is not the original colorway I don't believe I believe this is the uh, bloodsuckers variant I guess uh, he gets bit by a vampire or something some point, <laughs> but it's dope because I like I like the swords here, I like the colorway, I like the chocolates here, the Nike, the Nike chocolates here. Um, but yeah, all, 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 all in all, a really dope figure.
All right, so as you can see, it's a pretty decent sized figure. I believe it's like six inches, five, six inches, something of that effect. Um, very detailed, not very, not movable. It's obviously one pose. Um, the swords aren't removable or anything like that, but it's just an all around dope figure. I like the hand in the pocket, the, uh, the headband over the do-rag. Uh, the dual swords on the side, that's very dope. Um, <laughs> the socks, the socks with the, with the, with the slippers is funny, uh, but classic, because, you know, I know plenty of people that do that, even myself sometimes, uh, but yeah, so, the, I like the logo design for the Bloodsuckers, that's pretty cool, uh, I can see people putting like stickers of that once they get into into the franchise but it's an all around cool character man I'm really happy with this purchase um probably another one, again probably another one that I'm gonna end up keeping for myself <laughs> as I should um but yeah man so here we go so yeah so the first of the food stamps collectibles that I bought and I gotta say, I am very happy. It's a very dope figure. Uh, I like the details in it and the overall vibe. I really gotta make it a point to start reading the book soon. I'll probably do a review on that. Yeah, so if you like this figure, check out Food Stamps and Rio's Toy Design. So if you happen to get a chance to cop one of their figures, do so. Uh, I believe I got this one for about $130, which is pretty much right about how much they go for them. I haven't seen too many people trying to resell them on eBay, but if they did, I wouldn't be surprised if they, you know, were trying to sell it at a markup of, like, almost twice the price or something like that. So, all in all, good purchase. Very happy with this. Nice addition to the collection. With that being said, I'd like to thank y'all for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, comment down below, and, uh, as always, keep it nerdy. Peace.